What's going on guys? Welcome back to Civilization as the Inca on on Deity. Uh in the last part we we got some uh what do we do? We got plastics first of all. Uh we we made the Oxford University. Uh and we got for free penicillin, which is pretty cool because now we can get medical labs. We've got marines and an extra a uh, little trade cargo man there, and then also this dickhead decided to make a city right in between all of my cities just because there's some aluminum. Y yeah, okay. I mean, I probably could have blocked it had I not made the mistake. Uh, basically, there's this one turn where I forgot to move, and that's when he slipped on through and settled his city one turn before I actually got the aluminum myself. So I did not enjoy that very much. He ruined my empire. Just look at what he did. This looks ugly. What he did on the map there, it looks ugly. What? Oh, that that's gonna be bad. That's gonna be pretty bad. Alright, so he took Salvador. What? Greece has now adopted order because they absolutely have to. They don't like me at all. Alright, well, whatever. So he took Salvador, he took Rio de Janeiro, Brasilia, and he's burning every city that he can get his hands on. Which is both good and bad. It means that he will not be my neighbor. I appreciate that. At the same time, that's bad for Brazil because their cities are now permanently destroyed. I feel bad for the guy, but what are you going to do about it? Alright, yes. We need food in Tuanaku. This guy was going to make a, here we go, academy right there. Because that spot actually isn't that great. We just got some extra food from the farm. Uh, but it was only two. So I figured we might as well just get an academy. That would be better. And we're currently... Alright, let's get the camp. We're currently producing 630 signs per turn. Which, considering the fact we're on turn 230, that's not bad at all. We have artillery. Or, I mean, infantry. Uh, despite it only being 1600. So... I'm pretty sure it doesn't like mean all that much, but I sort of use that as an indicator like when I've got bombers and planes in say around the year 1400, I know that I'm, I'm doing pretty good. Uh, yeah, okay. So I want to keep that guy as a friend. I just got to be careful that... Shut your mouth, man. Got to be careful that Grace doesn't suddenly declare war on me and we really need to get a bigger military. Uh, which is something that we're going to be doing. As soon as this research lab is done, we're just getting a bigger military. Uh, we had a smaller military than Brazil had, and they got absolutely destroyed. And then also, we are now on the same level as uh, the the top players when it comes to science, and that's what I like to see. Uh, so we did good. We did good. Discovered dynamite. Even if... We, I'm not going to speculate, but even if we don't win the game... Uh, I still feel pretty good about being able to catch up in terms of science. I mean, you know, granted, uh, we had a pretty easy time of it, considering we're playing as the Inca, and look at Machu and how amazing it all is, but still, uh, that's pretty good. Give units. I, I can't do that. Man, they really did a number on Samarkand there. That's a lot of influence they have over him. I don't like seeing that. Alright, let's get railroad. So basically, in the capital, we're going to get more cargo ships over in Machu. We're going to um, start building units. Just a good amount of them. Uh, prepare for Greece. I mean, they're the only one that really... Shut up, dude. Uh, he's the only one that really poses a threat. I mean, he's currently in war with the Songhai still. I guess he, he brokered a peace deal with Brazil. Um, but I don't think he's actually fighting the Songhai. I mean, a little bit here and there, but not much is happening. So I'm just going to take this opportunity to raise my own army a little bit. Because right now it's really sad. All right, Wittenberg would like a road. That's not happening. Keep trading with Gao. Because that's some really good damn money. And then, all right, here you go. All right, don't really like the Lancer, but I'm not going to delete him quite yet. Actually, we have two Lancers. I don't like this at all. And Pocatello made the Kremlin. I just knew that this was going to happen. I still had at least a bit of hope that we might be able to... to grab that, but no, it's gone. He's made 18 wonders so far. 
If he ends up losing the game, then I don't know what he did. I only made two wonders, Porcelain Tower and Machu Picchu. I mean, those are pretty nice wonders, but I would have loved any of these, really. But that's Deity for you. Plotting against Mongolia, I'm gonna tell him about this. Share some of that intrigue, bruh. All right, so Alante Tombo's grown. Let's actually get to how I do. Yeah, let's work that for sure. My golden age is now ended. And over in the capital, as discussed, we're gonna get a cargo ship. We still have the... Uh, Christopher Dentor is still something that could be made. Uh, thing is, it will take far, far too long, even in Machu, which has the best production I currently have. <clears throat> Aside from that, it's not even... I mean, it's, it's, it's a good wonder, I think. Uh, it's just not that good where, shut up, where I would say, um, avoid making things like stock exchanges, banks, you know, all stuff like that. Anything that is more useful, I want to make first. So, like, the hospital, uh, the hydro plant, obviously. That would be really, really good to have in the capital. Because that would mean that about eight tiles or so, uh, would see extra production. That's really quite good. And I don't think we really need it any, anywhere else. That's good. We're only going to be using two aluminum. We're actually working on getting some more. Which we will need for the spaceship parts. Alright, Cusco. Nah, -uh, don't do that. Go in, into the research lab. Because of science. We actually got a whole lot of extra science from this. Because we're at 7.30 now. We're about to get another one in Machu, which is going to add a whole lot more. Because they're producing 153 science. 324, that's pretty good stuff. 115. Alright, either way, it's pretty good. But we also really gotta fix the happiness issues that we're having. So we're making the hospital here. Afterwards, Colosseum. And then, as soon as we make the Colosseum there, we can get the Circus Maximus in Cusco. And then we are good. To go. And then we got happiness, because right now it's a bit low. Manhattan Project for Alexander. That's just great, because I know that he's got uranium somewhere. No, what? Since when is Venice? He's looking to go to war with someone that's this far away from him. Triplane. Oh, this could actually turn really ugly. And they're still fighting each other. That's fun to see. All right, railroad is done. Tuanaku's grown. You know, just don't even work that anymore. Just keep working the better stuff. All right, Lancer, you can just chill here, I guess. I have nothing else for you to do. Sure, I'll buy the upgrade. And we lost Brussels. I, mean, I need Brussels, so I'm just gonna bribe him back. 140 for Wittenberg. All right, we're gonna have to wait a little bit longer, but at least we got Brussels back, which is good. Uh, all right, we dealt with the extra population. All right, so over in Machu, like I said, as much as I would like to make, for example, Neuschwanstein, uh, there's lots of things that we still need, and I feel like we should probably focus on that. So I'm gonna start with making one extra artillery, because we have none over here. And I'm gonna go ahead and grab flight, so we can actually get some of the better planes, even though we don't have any oil. Yeah, we have no oil anywhere. And it looks like none of the city-states that I've allied myself with actually have any. Alright, well, we'll figure it out eventually, I guess. Uh, almost 800 signs per turn. Hospital almost done. Alright, cargo ship, let's just get that out of the way, first of all. Progress already been, already been made. 56. I should be the tech leader now. Okay. Oh, of course he's got one more. One technology more. Stupid Greece. I'm just waiting for... I guess the Shoshone to fight him, but that's not going to happen, is it? Look how big their army is. This is not going to go well. Three aluminum. Why would he destroy Belo Horizonte instead of just keeping it as a puppet? I don't really understand. Alright, you're good. That looks really nice. Quite defensive. There we go. 
All right, let's get some more uh, trade trading posts. Yeah, that's what they're called. All right, this guy. So here's an option that I okay. We're actually at unhappiness now, which is bad. So we're gonna go ahead and make a coliseum, which will take three turns. You're gonna make me another cargo ship, and then the existing one is going to go to Tiwanaku. I think. Yeah, go to Tiwanaku. You're good. And by good, I, I mean absolutely useless. And then much is ground. That's good. Go to the research lab. Get me that science right there. A boy. And then. All right, let's see. Happiness from monuments is actually pretty bad because, I mean, we do get eight happiness, which is nice, but the extra speed is is not very good at all. I actually really want to hear other people to get me uh, some engineers, so I'm going to go with that. It's not going to fix my happiness straight away, but I can't just pick um, tenants just because they're going to temporarily fix my happiness. Priorities, people. Priorities. I need engineers, and that's going to take forever and a half to actually get. Yeah, that's a no for me. Apparently, I have oil now. I do. Where am I getting oil? Oh, right, from here. So I did have oil, and I was completely incorrect earlier. Disregard all of that. That person that left a comment saying, you do have oil, you stupid idiot, is he's going to feel like an idiot now. Because he's the one that left a comment, even though slightly later on, I realized that I was wrong, so... All right, Coco to Pocatello and See, that's bad. We got to trade with them again. Give me some more of that wine, bruh. And then, all right, trading post because of science. And then these guys can actually send food to Alante Tombo, uh, which I think is important enough to actually do. All right, this one's almost done. Working on the artillery. All right, so from now on, I kind of just want to focus on military units for at least a while. I want to see a decent army here uh, that can at least defend this area. As long as this gets closed off by my borders, then nobody can enter my territory without me knowing. Greece will not be able to sneak up on me, and that's what I want to see. Because they're not going to attack from the south. I know that. Brazil denounced Songhai. And they've also... Okay, so they make peace, and then they denounce each other in the same turn. Super reasonable. Greece stole Vilnius for me. They gave them a bit of money, I'm assuming. Alright, so we can trade with the new cargo ship. So, some market wants to trade. So, let's go ahead and do that. Get some easy influence there. Then also, let's see. We've got one turn to do something. So, I guess what we'll do is we'll just get a... Sure, let's get a work boat. Why not? Why not do that? And then we're going to get Vilnius back, though. Because I really do need Vilnius on my side. They're apparently giving me some type of luxury, which is uh, keeping my happiness from going to hell. And we've got a decent amount of money as well, so that's good. Jesus Christ. They have so much more money than I do. I mean, they all just have thousands and thousands of gold saved up, except for Brazil. But Brazil clearly sucks ass at this point. They have nothing. They have two cities. I guess they get a lot of score from their religion as well. All right, we've discovered flight. Borders of Alante Tomov ground, so that's going to be a little bit of extra. Ooh. Hold on a second. Yeah, this is what I'm going to do, actually. I don't think Circus Maximus really needs to be in the capital. So over in the capital, I'm going to make this hydro plant, which I was talking about. It's going to go there. And then over in, we'll just pick Alante Tombo, and that's where we'll make Circus Maximus, because that city is basically garbage to me anyway. I mean, it's the, le it's the worst of the cities that I have. Here we go. All right, you go there. Protect the flanks. All right, here we go. 
Let's get more training posts. Because of science. And then, alright, you're good. You're good. Alright, we're gonna vote soon. That's good to know. We cannot steal from Mongolia. Vilnius would like some units for me. So Marco's happy with me for the trait route, so I can actually get them back for a measly 250 gold. So let's just go ahead and do that straight away. And then over in Machu, we're going to be making one more artillery. I think a 2-3 artillery, it, just to be safe. And I think what we should do is probably just go after ballistics first of all. Uh, for the machine guns and the anti-aircraft. Then again... I just want to get to atomic theory. You know what? Let's go for at atomic theory first. I don't feel that we necessarily need machine guns straight away. Uh, use useful as it might be. And we can actually buy an engineer, so I'm going to just do that straight away. Just to have that one guy at the ready. What is up with this? Comanche Riders. Yeah, that's a definite no from me. This guy's been in involved in several wars. In fact, isn't he fighting... He's fighting Greece right now. I'm not doing this. He's got nothing to offer me anyway. And I lost Wittenberg, but that's okay, because they're only giving me a bit of faith. And chances are we're not going to be getting... Um, Another thousand or like fifteen hundred faith, which is what we need for an engineer. So I'm I'm fine. There we go. All right. So just do that. Get a bit of extra food for Tuanaku, a bit of gold. Not a big deal. Genghis Khan is planning against Askia. I'm gonna tell him about that. Brussels would like a trade route. We can probably get that going soon as well. All right. This everything is looking pretty good. I'm still waiting for Tuanaku to just get that factory done because the city right now is kind of trashy. And they need things like a hospital uh, to really function. They still need a public school and the research lab. So right now they're not really... I mean, they're giving me a good amount of science, but it's not that good. Shut up. I'm not getting involved. And Zurich is gone. Are you kidding me, Mongolia? I, that was my ally. Oh my god, that's going to cost me a bunch of happiness. I was getting... Yeah, I was just getting happiness from that. I'm pretty sure they're a, a um, mercantile city-state, but still, that's annoying. Why would you do this? We just, so we no longer get iron, aluminum, ivory, coal, happiness, and then porcelain. That was a great city-state to have as an ally, and it's all gone and ruined. Thanks for absolutely nothing, Mongolia. Now I need to find another ally. All right, you're good. Artillery, Circus Maximus. We got to get more. We got to get zoos. You know what? No, actually, finish the hydro plant, but the other cities are going to make me some zoos. Because if we don't do this, then happiness is going to just start just sucking ass. We got to fix the situation as soon as we can. Crystal Redentor for Alexander, because why not? It's eight wonders, 18. I never even realized how many world wonders were in the game until recently. Protecting Brussels, all right, good luck with that. Hope that Venice doesn't buy them or Mongolia kill them. They're probably going to go after Kiev next, which I certainly do not appreciate. Because that's another ally that I actually really enjoy having. All right, let's see. I think we're pretty much done over here. We could probably throw a farm on this tile, make it slightly better. Alright, five more turns. Alright, so after the artillery here, we're just going to get a zoo. Because if we don't, then happiness is going to... We cannot allow it to drop even more. That's going to be really bad. I don't like really bad. And I don't think any city-state can really... 
offer me all that much right now. Okay, Louvre has been built. Venice and Mongolia have made a research agreement. And French with the Shoni has run its course. That's a no uh, from me. Stay away from me. All right, this is good. So this city is now completely gone. Now, like I said earlier, I could settle there, but I still have national wonders to make. Building up for a sneak attack. We cannot steal from the Shoshone or Songhai. This guy is ready to fight. So let's just move everybody into this pass or whatever this is. Make sure no enemy military gets through. There you go. It's all blocked off. Venice can't settle there, which means that nobody can actually get to this spot anymore, which is how I like to see it. All right. So with that out of the way, get me a zoo. Get me a zoo, a zoo as soon as you possibly can. Grab a farm over there. All right. Trading post. See, Tiwanaku's getting better with all these training posts. This is going to be... Amazing. All right, so let's just get the um, Circus Maximus out of the way and the factory as well. Yes, definitely want to stay friends with you. We have no problems except for me stealing a little bit of technology. But what's a little bit of technology among friends? I'm sure you don't actually mind. You're just acting like you're like you're angry with me to save face internationally. He's got 310 population. What the f How? How does that even work? What a jerk. All right. Alante Tombo. I'm going to just go for, with a zoo for now. So I'm going to help him out with one vote and then I'm going to say for my own thing, international games. Heck yeah, let's do it. Because that's going to also allow me to get a little bit of extra happiness. Tionaku is going to get the public school because right now they're just bad. And we need more science to fix everything. There you go. Alright, we can't actually stand on El Dorado. Alright, this is good. Set up for that ranged attack. You do the same. And that's all that we really need. Hopefully we can get our hands on the spices soon because we can instantly just get them. Because there's still plantation on there, despite there not actually being a city anymore. And we're at minus one happiness right now, which is still not good, but it's slightly better. So all we really got to do is just get more allies. Like, for example, Ragusa. And, okay. We also really got to find more city-states. I know there are more out there. I'm not going to do this. Alright, we're just going to make a ship or something soon so that we can... Um, Send that out there and try to explore the coastline. Hopefully find more city-states that we can ally ourselves with. Alright, this will just have to do for now. But this still sucks. I don't like having negative happiness at all. And just making a zoo every couple of turns is only going to help so much because we're growing at such a steady pace. Nope. Maybe I can trade for the Shoshone's dies later. Although I don't have any luxuries that he might want. I could give him money for it, but he's going to ask way too much, I'm guessing. Probably more than seven per turn. All right, they both passed. That's good. Friendship with Venice has run its course. All right, so we're going to trade with Brussels, right? Alright, they're not starving. We're going to trade with Brussels. And then I'm going to propose that we do a world ideology order. No, world ideology. And then order. Venice and Brazil won't like it, but I don't care. This will get me extra votes, which is what I need. And then... Alright, so we're trading with Brussels. I'm going to just see if he wants to part with his... Pressure. Okay, he does have dies, but he's probably going to ask for, like, way more than this. Nine? Oh, there you go. That's actually not bad. Uh, all right, so that's going to keep us afloat for at least a little while longer. It's still not great, but he did kind of save our ass there, which is appreciated. And, okay, Tondibi has been captured by Grace. That's bad. 
Oh boy. He is unstoppable, man. I'm just hoping that the Shoshone sooner rather than later will be able to stop him. At least Brussels likes me. Vilnius is looking for science. They're also in awe of me, so Brussels should be a really good ally at this point. Uh, Alright, tr keep trading with Gal because of money. Everybody loves the king, which is actually not that great because it means they're going to keep growing. Alright, so we got the zoo. Uh, let's get one infantry because we only have three over here. Yeah, let's get some more. I feel like we should have at least six or so. I really don't want to be all that vulnerable. Uh, I only have slightly more soldiers than Brazil, and Brazil got absolutely demolished by Greece. And there's another settler. What's he trying to get? Oh, probably the citrus. Did he... wait. Did he resettle Salvador? That's a bit weird. That's kind of weird. I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Uh, they made the Statue of Liberty. I mean, good for you, I guess. It's not like I was actually able to make that at any point whatsoever. Neuschwanstein. I could make this, and I do want to make it because I like the wonder. But sometimes some other th things take priority. Alright, that's 6,000 science, which is pretty good. Do I want to rush this? Or do I want one more academy? I'm actually leaning towards using him. Actually, we could make a... Okay, let's make an academy right here. I think because that's one of the only good spots uh, left for it. We don't want to remove any jungle. This is probably the best thing to do. All right, still not starving, so that's good. Trade with Washeki. Get me my money. And then in the capital, we're going to just go ahead and grab, uh, just really quickly, just grab a... I'm not really sure. Let's just grab a zoo before we do anything else. We have the luxury to actually do that now, so let's do it. And, uh, all right, so we're going to do that. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it here for now. In the next part, we're hopefully going to get access to some uranium that would be really cool and i'm guessing that probably in sometime in the next part we're gonna get really close to that 1000 science uh, per turn which we need uh but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed thank you very much for watching and i'll talk to you later